Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, we will see a uh, easiest vulnerability to find, which is a missing FPS record bug. So, in this video, I will teach you how what is SPF record, how to find it, what are its impact, if it is, if it is easiest to find, and we will also see report breakdown too. So, let's get into the video. So as you can see that here we are on here we are on our computer screen. So first of all, let me start with what is SPF record. Okay, so let me zoom the words. So here you can see that SPF record, which is sender policy framework, is an email authentication method designed to detect forging sender addresses during the delivery of the May email. SPF alone through it is is limited to detecting a forged sender claim in the envelope of the email which is used when the mail gets bounced so simply the spf record is a method to authenticate the sender okay in simple words so what are its impact if you can find spf record vulnerability so the impacts are spf records are used to prevent spammers from spoofing on of spoofing your domain but some email admins don't see it that way despite the fact that without an spf record spammer can spoof your domain name to spam other networks harming your brand's reputation so ultimately the spf record is used to spam or spoof from your domain and harm your brand's reputation okay so how to find it okay so first of all let me show you on which website we are finding it so we are testing this on test php on testphp.wellnweb.com so let me copy this website here and now let me normal the word let me decrease the size of words now let's go to the p let's go to the text again this one and here you can see that webs we are going to use to find this so there are two webs which are available online to find this vulnerability so first of all we are going to kitten man so let me go to my browser here and now type kitten man kitten man and hit enter and you will get something like this imdb and other things but you have to go to kitten man spf so you can type kitten man spf checker or i'm clicking on kitten man spf <coughs> Yes, here you go. Here to to this website kittenman.com slash spf slash validate. So let me click on it. It's opening. Now here you can see that there are a bunch of things written here. You don't have to focus on them. Here how to find this vulnerability. You have to enter the domain of the web to find it to find this vulnerability. Let me type here google.com. And now let me click on this button get as spf record here you can see that we are getting spf record of google all this thing now let me go back and paste the link we copied testphp.oneweb.com and remember to remove the http or https because i don't know why it it just says no if it, it is available if the record is available then it also say no record available so be sure be rem remember to remove the http or https now after typing my vulnerable website click on get spf record now here you can see that no spf record found so so that this one this domain is vulnerable to spf record vulnerability missing spf record vulnerability okay it's simple you have to just copy the domain here and remove http or https and hit enter if you get the record then the domain is not vulnerable if you get no record then the domain is vulnerable okay so now as i said let's go to the report breakdown here is a link report 629087 now let me copy it now let me go to the browser and paste the link here 
hacker on report 69087 and here you can see that the vulnerability name is no valid spf record found and the main thing is you are getting bounty of 500 dollar okay so it is a paid bounty it's a paid bug actually and here you can see that a report is written here like description there is email spoofing vulnerability on your website and blah 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 other things I found SPF record lookup and validation for chain dot link the, web, the vulnerable website is this one and the txt record found on your domain are this one basically checked on kitten man as you if you observed that uh, results then you will also getting this thing too okay so checking to see if there is a valid vulnerable valid spf record so found record chain and other things so here you can see it's a remediation 2 and references okay and it's impact 2 so, so you can also read this report i will mention the link in the description so you can check this out okay and i if you want to double check that it has a spf record or not then you can also use mx toolbox tool but see it is not perfect sometimes it says that you are blocked or sometimes it shows random error i don't know why here it is opening enter the domain name let me type google.com and click on mx lookup you can see that there is nothing showing here yeah here you can see that you are getting the SPF record too and if I paste the test php test php dot one web dot com and hit enter then you can see that there is no DNS record published there then there is no SPF record available you can see here okay so this is for this video thanks for watching like share and subscribe to my youtube channel and if you have any query related to bug bounty or ethical hacking then you can ping me on my instagram handle i also mentioned that link in the description